This is part one of how to use Tasiatron to follow Ben Eater's 6502 YouTube series. Create a new project and add the breadboard component. Add the 6502 processor component. Connect the processor power and ground pins. Connect the ready, interrupt requests, non-maskable interrupt and bus enable pins to high. Add the clock and set the frequency to 500 milliseconds. Connect the clock power and ground pins. Connect the clock signal to the processor clock input pin. Connect the set overflow pin on the processor to high and add a button with the invert parameter as true. Connect pin 1 of the button to high and pin 2 to the reset pin of the processor. Add 5 LED components and ground the cathode pins. Connect the first 5 processor address pins to the anode pins of the LEDs. Hard code the hex value EA on the processor data bus by connecting the pins to high or low values. Run the simulation. The clock toggles at 2 Hz. You can see activity on the processor address bus. Press the button to reset the processor to repeat the sequence. Stop and restart the simulation. Step through several clock cycles. Examine the data and address values of the processor. Notice that the program counter will start to increment.